Welcome back to Improvision Entertainment. My name is Hunter Munn, and this is Far Cry 6. And sorry about that last recording. Hopefully I remember to grab it. Rank up. To what does it do? New weapons and gear available at arms dealers. That's all it does? Military presence increased. Stronger FND units have been deployed throughout Yara. Okay, let's talk to... Club Retired HQ. Actually, let's take a glance at the map. Oh, are we just going to move moving from island to island? All right. Supremo. Hell of an office one. Hold on. There's a box. I prefer Guerrilla Tuxedo. Is it on the other side of the wall? I guess it is. I'm gathering gasoline inside of your base for your, for, for your base. That makes sense, right? Calma. Must be up a level. Ah, my favorite guerrilla. What is this? Cigar box? U.S. dog tag charm. Huh. All right, what do you got for me? Uh, hold on, this might be copyright. Danny, back for more. Want yep. to make you the best supremos and resolver weapons? You need depleted uranium. Lucky for you, Castillo has stashed his supply with the biggest guns on the island, his anti-aircraft cannons. Sure. When you got some of that sweet uranium, you can bring it back to my office, or to one of my associates. If you capture an FND base, a member of Team Juan will move in and give you access to my inventory. And don't forget, rank has its privileges. When Clara is kind enough to promote you, we'll be able to hook you up with better gear. Just have those pesos okay. ready. Even in Revolution, nothing comes free. And here's so some I'm advice. Guerrilla up. to guerrilla. Have some fun, for fuck's sake. Die with a smile on your face. Okay. Time for a superhero team up, Danny. My weapons and your skills. Okay. You'll be back. They always come back. Check what's in the store. Uh, Stealth Supremo. Emit an EMP pulse to knock over enemies, disable security systems, and enable vehicle hijacking. Oh, so it's not stealth as much as it's... Well, I mean EMP. Create chaos by launching poison onto the battlefield. Emit an explosive ring that roasts enemies. Press jump to thrust forward in midair. Hmm. El Cesaro... I mean, being able to pull out the rocket launchers is pretty good. I just wish I could do it a little more often. Yes, hello? Juan, I swear you almost look happy. I have my workshop and a revolution to win. What more could a guerrilla ask for? Sure. Dr. Clara? All right. Clara's Command Center. Sounds like copyright. Once you're back at Santuario, shake the trees for guns, ammo, new believers. Cause you were surprised. Let's keep it that way. Welcome to Libertad, Danny. I can leap any time. What's the rush? Inspiring. Mm. Let's free Yara, shall we? Ooh. Ooh, I gotta kill. Castile controls all of Yara with soldados, slaves, and blood. The capital is a stronghold. We take Esperanza, we free Yara. Best chance we got to weaken Castillo is to hit military targets like FND bases and checkpoints. 
but most important, we have to surround Esperanza and trap Castillo in his cage. That means targeted operations that will unite the revolution and make Libertad stronger. To do that, I need you okay. to recruit three groups in Yara to fight with Libertad. Each is waging war across Yara with a different piece of Castillo's empire, all controlled by his inner circle. In El okay. Este, foreign invaders like Mickey Industries suck our resources dry, and Admiral Benitez defends Castillo's poison lifeline. But the old legends of 67 can help us turn the tide. They're hiding in the jungles of the highest mountains of Yara. Their greatest guerrilla, El Tigre, is waiting with open arms to help you bring them on our side. Okay. Then we have Valle de Oro. Not just the engine of Castillo's Viviro operation, but also his propaganda machine, run by his Minister of Culture, Maria Marquesa. But I have some old friends who can run our counter-propaganda campaign, Maximas Matanzas. They were the voice of the protests and can mobilize Yara's dissidents to fight for Libertad. They've gone dark. Last seen at a fort in Balaceras. We need to find them before Castillo's forces do. In Madrugada, hmm. we have Castillo's nephew, Jose, a slave driver who forces outcasts to grow that poison Viviro tobacco. But the Montero family is waging war against Jose. They hate visitors, but I have intel on a mechanic who has a workshop in Costa del Mar. His name is Fili Barsaga, and he's their gatekeeper. If I were you, Danny, I'd start in Madrugada. We take back that tobacco with the Montero's help, and we got Castillo's Viviro at the source. You just need to find this mechanic, Philly. I'll be here actioning targeted Libertad strikes against Castillo throughout Yara. Hang on. I'm gonna get all these groups to sign up for Libertad by myself? How? Sort of. Simple. You help. Any way you can. I kind of want to take out the big capitalists first, to be perfectly honest. I send a squad to these groups, I'm an invader. I send a scout, then I'm not serious. With you... They get my best career without politics and bullshit. Just help. Libertad takes the capital, we slit Anton's throat, maybe drink his blood, etc., etc. Then he needs a walk. Viva Libertad, Jefa. Yeah, yeah. I'm not Clara's best career. You are. You're not listening. Translate, Juan. The accent. Clara hides it best she can, but she was born rich. From a family of true yarn she left behind. She can shoot, bleed, drink with us all she wants, but she can't hide the stink of the upper class. What's that have to do with me? You are an orphan, Danny. Poor, from the dirt. When they see you, they don't see politics. They see they have no excuse. She's using me. See? <laughs> I you're mean, using yeah. her right back. Do you want to kill Anton? See? Do you want to free Yara? Sure you do. But here's what Clara can't say, but you and I both know. You want this. You're a guerrilla. And for a guerrilla, the shit my pants rush of an ambush, the smell of sulfur burning your nostrils, it's... It's... It's fun. Don't worry. All right, then. It's fun. Your secret is safe with me. Smash another. Operation completed the gorilla. Operation meet the legends. Operation meet the Monteros. Monteros. Extra content now available. All of your extra and purchase content is now yours. Visit the arsenal, amigos, rides, and vehicle pickup menus to access your new content. Oh. Oh baby, oh baby. Mmm. Sniper rifle. The K9000. I'm about to get absolutely illogical. I don't know what the I wonder what the cyber eye does. Whoa, it's level four. I don't even think I can equip that yet. Okay, okay, we're gonna go through the whole animation anyway. Um, cyber eye does what? 
Tag nearby enemies after tag nearby enemies after takedown kills. That's how I play. That wouldn't be bad. We'll go with that. I pressed the wrong button. All right, what's the this gear? Improves armor piercing and blast defense. Okay, not terrible. That reduces noise, so we're going to keep that on for the moment. Improves sniper rifle ammo reserve, or... Speed after sliding is actually kind of throwing off my momentum a little bit. I like those pants. I've always liked those pants. What do we got on the boots? Improves move speed after taking damage. Let's do after taking damage. And what's the uh, arm do? Greatly improves weapon sway. Improves throwing knife and throwing axe. Oh. If I really want to be silent from afar, I should go with throwing axe. What do I currently have on? Oh, I have the... Stop getting lit on fire. Oh. And that's going to keep dinging, but also... Alright. What do you... Body regulation. So I guess that's regeneration? K9000. Your metal badass friend receives less bullet damage and gains immunity to poison and fire. Stealth amigo. Are you not stealth? You're combat. Chorizo? Chorizo? Those are the evil uh, Chozo, aren't they? Alright, well, I got a stealth. Let's go puppy! Puppy, you're so shiny! Nice. Who's ringing? Okay, what I want right now is this. Rank 3. Does that mean if I walk up to him, he's going to deny me? It might. Oh, I got to scan all the boats, too? All right. All right, sploosh. And... Let's see, let's go here? That looks like a major port. Whoa, boats have never been this sleek moving in. Okay, hold on. Do I need to go... No, I basically need to go straight at it. I assume that there will be enemy boats on the screen. Danny, yeah? Okay. What makes them so special? They're no. specially trained and heavily armed. Fuck you, smartass. But yes, you've been warned. So if I just willy-nilly kill soldiers, they'll send dudes after me? Or what do you mean? Aren't I all aren't all I'm doing is killing soldiers? That was an enemy boat on my left. Nice music. I'm gonna need a fast travel point, guys. I'm gonna head straight at this, uh... Uh... I'm losing it. Been at, been at this for nine hours. Um... Lighthouse. Jeez. Oh my god, word. This is a lot of water, though. I kind of suspect that we're gonna have speedboats and stuff in this game. Alrighty, well, not much to talk about on the way. I don't know. 
Reef shark hunting spot. New hunting spot revealed. That looks like it could be a base on the left. Fort Santa Maria. Military target. New military target revealed. Velo de Oro. Clara, I'm on my way to Valle de Oro. Good. That's what I, I said. Hope you find Maximus Matanzas. How do you know them anyway? Valia and I led the first protests against Castillo, while Paolo mobilized the dissidents. We lost contact after the Esperanza riots. I saw those riots. A lot of people got hurt. Okay. Stop it. I assume red markers are bad. Lara, I'm near El Este. And history is repeating itself. What do you mean? This is the land where legends are born, Danny. The 67 revolutions started in El Este. El Tigre, La Quimama, Lorenzo, Lobo, they led the guerrillas who overthrew Castillo's father, Gabriel. Libertad is taking Yara full circle. And they know I'm coming to give them the good news? El Tigre is very, very excited. Promise. What is that? Ambush? Ambush? Well, what am I doing? I'm gonna need... Something that looks like a city? No, I guess I better... I, I guess for safety's sake, I need to go... Why did they... What about this? I think somebody's buzzing in. El Tigre? That's me. You must be that kid Clara mentioned. Libertad's chosen one. I'm not a kid. Of course not. Your baby Tigre. And don't worry. I'll make sure you don't end up one of Benitez's trophies. Who's Benitez? Head of Castillo's Navy, a real sea monster. She likes to hang traitors like fish for all of El Este to see. Pal carajo. Well, I'm in El Este now. I love it. <coughs> all of it. You, uh, have a long night? The rum and coke was flowing last night, baby tigre. Minus the coke. Been there? I'm sending you some photos. Should help you find us. Is that a crab? Rock? See, si. Call me when you get there. And bring grappling gear. You're going to need it. Now get moving up our mountain. We can't wait to meet you, baby tigre. You follow up on me, Spooky. What do you got? Hola, yeah. Danny. If you love sipping a cappuccino while killing soldados, you're going to love this. The soldados control a coffee factory nearby. All the mm. farmers in this area have to bring their crop there to be officially counted. Okay. But the soldados always keep some for themselves. Gracias, gracias. Santa Gusto's coffee factory. All right, cool. Oh, yeah. Guerrilla, the legends live up in the mountains, as far away from the modern world as you can get. You sure you want to be here? Hey, puppy. It's time for pets. You're glorious. Boy. Oh, your 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 little dog tag is a is a is a QR code. That's awesome. I love it. Nice touch. S Stop directing me up the fine. I'll, I'll keep going this way. We're gonna meet these people. I'm gonna ignore whatever that is. Hola. Hola. Oh, if I can expand the gear, then I can get... Wait, hold on. I already have throwing knives, don't I? I do have throwing knives. Nice ominous music.
Um... Really? Repair tool doesn't light things on fire anymore? Oh god, oh god! Why did that suddenly burst into fire? Uh, this thing is made of wood. Should I be concerned? Puppy's immune to fire. I mean, I guess that works. Why can't I pick it up again? Yeah! I'm right here, I'm in its face. Let me pick it up! Ow! Ow my everything! I... I regret nothing? Except it sounds like this entire... Thi God damn it! Let me have the thing! Excuse me? Is this thing breaking apart with me in it and turning into material? Go to watch out. <laughs> Automatically collected jaguar meat. This is crazy, I can't pick up this box right now. Why can't I pick up the- Okay. Puppy, you look like a dog from hell. I appreciate it. Whoa, okay. I want to swing a knife at it, but like, that doesn't do anything. Actually, that, that dot kind of looks like it's behind it. How are you supposed to... No okay, good grief. Some buggy with that. I don't want to be here right now. Oh well. I guess I'll get it later. I presume I need all of them for a collectible achievement or something, so if that's bugged, then I won't be able to get all the achievements. But you know, Ubisoft games, they need patches. And even then, they need patches, even though they don't get them. Not not all the patches. They need more patches. New hunting spot revealed, hare hunting spot. Okay, I guess we're leaning into that, because that's happening a lot now. I didn't see any horses on this island, otherwise I would have taken another way here. But instead I'm just running through the woods. Hopefully this guy is going to tell me to go on my way since I'm not high enough level. Another one of these. Wait, why did that break after two swings? And I can collect it. What the hell? 
Oh, I'm sorry. Did did you walk? Oh, I thought you were stationary over there. Hi, excuse me. This pardon me. Come useful. in there. I filled up my talk bubble. What can bubble. you tell me? Ever wonder how the soldados get their orders in the listed? Answer is the radio station at the top of the mountain nearby. They turn that place into a fort. If you walk in, stay out of sight. They'll shoot you there and throw you off the mountain. Thanks. Oh man, taking a radio tower? Classic. Let's do that. But not right now. Right now we're gonna get at least the uh, introduction to this region. Let's see what's happening. Hey, El Tigre. I'm at the Crab Rock. Very artistic. Lorenzo's the artist, and we guerrillas are like the crabs. Hard shells? Sharp claws? They fight from the jungle to give birth in the ocean. We fought from the ocean and gave birth to La Revolution. See, si. I got it. Take the footpath up the mountain, very easy. A guerrilla must be sure-footed, like a goat. Goat? I thought we were like a crab. Hello? Pinga. Pupper! What have you got to do to level up, Pupper? Arf? That doesn't sound right. Are you guys just leaving this stuff around? It's like nobody owns it. I heard a goat. The view from the waterfall was so beautiful. Seeing the wall of 67 gave me chills. My grandmother told me if you continue past the waterfall, there's a path leading right to the legend's secret camp. The legends? Hmm. They're still alive? Depends who you ask. My grandmother said she had dinner with Lorenzo last week. But she also talks to her dead cousin. So, who knows? Isn't that a little dangerous? Tell Castillo he's an idiot for me, Guerrilla. It's very dark. I can only assume I'm going up the path. Which is very dark. Hello, goat. I could kill you for meat. Hover. Looks like the waterfall from El Tigre's photo. We yep. get up there. That's only half of the story. They used to love each other. El Tigre. I'm at the waterfall picture. It was taken after a bloody battle. Three days of hiding paid off when a platoon of paratroopers landed right in our kill zone. Planning and patience are Garia's best friends. Those a handful of grenades. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I get it. Oh, good. I was going the right way. I just wanted to make sure it wasn't like. Hold on, wait. I sensed a gravel point. This will be easy, he says. Be like a goat, he says. Looks so peaceful from up here. So much nice music. Do, 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 do. Huh. Ow! What? Oh my god, are eagles back? I don't need that. Nobody needs that in their life. Goats. Fucking show offs. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Be a fucking show. Oops. Do I have to do that again? Whoa, that seems dangerous. Hold on, wait. Surely there must be a more forward falling equation. Aha. Aha. 
Up and at them. New picture. Do I want to use zip line? Yeah, I guess I do. Baby Tigre, after the war, that path became a famous hiking trail for sweaty touristas. They'd visit our camp, leave their shit everywhere, take photographs of us like we were animals in a zoo. So, we might have accidentally lit a few dynamite sticks and might have accidentally blocked the trail. Then I might have to accidentally unblock it. Exactly! <laughs> I love it! By shooting or blowing up the nets holding the rocks. Um, I should probably not be in the way of that. How many Molotovs do I have? Fire solves everything. I was about to say, fire should burn that net. Everyone okay? I'm not checking. I was just, just generally curious. Out of character. Metagaming. Hey, sun's coming up. Couple of frame drops. Oh god! Wow, I got hit so hard I went into third person. Well. Alright, alright. No need to rumble me. I'm on a loading screen. Where, where? What? Where am I? Oop. Oh no. Shit. Don't get too close. Yeah, I'm back a little ways. I already have the uh, Molotov ready. Oh, okay. So it's already blown up. That's good. Weird for the checkpoint to be so far back, but all right. Okay, I think there was a feed button there, and my reflex was to get meat, so that's on me. Excuse me? That was so de debatably death that it was like, open your parachute. This is so precarious. I feel like I'm about to... Hold on. I heard that. I heard scree!
black hawk meat. Fucking hawk. Eagle hawk. Same idea. Okay. Pupper running up on me. Can really disappear up here. Would make an army blind. I don't think that's a goat. Is that a deer? How is the air both thick and thin at the same time? didn't say that loud enough. Fucking bird. I'm on to you! And your BS. Okay, I, th I think we're going for tallest Far, Far Cry game, because this has been quite the climb. Okay. I'm at the next picture. Let me guess. Guerrillas are like sharks. Deadly predators with knives as sharp as teeth. Actually, that rock just looked like a shark. Who's the one dangling underneath it? That's Lucky Mama. We never knew when the soldado would find our camp. So we had to secure fast ways up and even faster ways down. Lucky always volunteered to be the first to test the lines. Brave. I hear you're brave, too. Clara told me about you. You know, I also grew up without a mama or papa. And you still became a legend. <laughs> Many guerrillas are orphans, baby Tigre. But it's not our parents who define us. It's our actions. It's like therapy. <laughs> yes, yeah, Star Wars. Better when we didn't know who Ray's parents were, that she was just nobody and could use the force. Then you had to screw it all up. Is that is that three year spoilers? I'm too toasty to know if that's three year spoilers. El Tigre, I'm at the statue. Ah, Lobo. Lobo? That explains the hangover. Every year I drink two bottles of rum. One for me, and one for Lobo. He never lived to see a free Yara. To be honest, neither did I. This is the hmm. last pick. Felicidades! You're at the top of the world! Now get down here! You're missing all the fun, baby tigre! Read. Guerrero Lobo Hernandez, 1949 to 1967. Always the first to raise his fist against injustice, Lobo never saw the end of the revolution. He fell before the final assault on Esperanza. This monument was raised by the legends in 67. In his memory, rest now, friend. The fight is won. Is it, though? It still feels like we're still doing it. Meet at the camp. Oh, you said get down here. I thought you were going to make me, like, jump off the mountain. Because that seems like a very Far Cry thing to do. Puppy, you are so chrome right now. I love it. I actually love it. I can't wait to play Blood Dragon again. I wonder... If... I'm so worried if it holds up. Patri uh, Patriotis Peak. The hell? Why am I in third person? What happened? My reality is unhinged. The last joke you told me almost made me puke. Some reaction is better than nothing at all. I would have preferred nothing at all. Well, when this is over and I invite you to my first comedy show, I'll give you a paper bag. 
<laughs> wow. Never thought I'd actually want to get killed in combat before. Keep that beast away from me. Inside search zone. Why am I in third person? And why is it a thing? This is not a bad camera angle for third person. What do we got? Read. Scribbled note. Don't forget to ask Siegfriedo about the pelican flying up on the mountain. It might mean that the lady isn't around anymore. Hopefully everything's okay. New treasure hunt. Okay. Objective complete, apparently. El tigre. What a dandy! Hi. What the hell? You're trapped. That is staring you in the face. What do you do? <laughs> I've been kicked in the cojones a thousand times. I haven't felt them since '72. Hey. Never do that again. What? At the castle to Casa, baby tigre. Come on, me and the family. Lucky. Okay. My nose is broke again. I'm not your fucking mother. Lucky mama? There are people out there who are actually hurt. I am suffering. I easy mama. Herpes doesn't count. Meet Lorenzo Canseco, poet of the legends. Well, I sense the hot blood of a fighter. Lorenzo Kazik. And of course, you know Lucky Mama, heart of the legends. It's not broken. Really? I felt it go crazy. <laughs> 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 hmm. Looks like La Morale to me. I'm Danny Rojas from Libertad. The new feast of the revolution. No, Clara sent me. Libertad needs the legends on our side, heroes to believe in. To fight another Castillo? He's exactly what Yara deserves. Buena suerte. Sorry, one revolution was enough. Looks like okay. that I was wrong. Have faith, Danny. They just need to get to know you. Come see me when you get settled. My baby tigre. <laughs> baby tigre. Stop hitting me. Did I have on that cybernetic guy during the cutscene? I don't know. Why am I in third person? Guerrilla camp facilities. I knew there was still tutorial left. Talk to the foreman and consult the construction debt to build camp facilities? Really? Building upgrade camp facilities to access various benefits and unlock different specializations to fit your needs. New yarn story revealed. Alright, what is this? Scribbles on a coffee can and wrapper. The time is set, the FND inspector noted the missing beans in the last few shipments from Boda's farm. They are planning something. Maybe we set up a double cross and stop them at their own game? If we get rid of the set of Soledos, the locals will rejoin the Whisper Network. I'm sure of it. I just realized I hadn't looked over at the chat in a while, but nobody's talking. So that's fine. What is that icon? Spec Ops and Black Market. Uh, def what the hell? Oh, this is rank three recommended, and I happen to just barely be rank three. Clara, I've met the legend. El Tigre is the only one on board with Libertad. Do whatever you have to and get them to join this fight. The people need heroes to believe in. I just hope they still want to be heroes. I'm going to take a walk around our camp. Check out what they've got. Okay, Danny. Stay in touch. No way. When? Like two years ago. You need to freshen up that gear. Coño's the guerrilla. What can I do for you, Danny? Benito. Feel like being a pirate again? We need resources, intel, allies. Only you can get them. I'll send you anyone I rescue. They will be happy to stick it to Anton. Soon, you'll have your own little pirate army. Benditos huh. banditos. I can't lie to you. I like the sound of that. Start sending people my way, and I'll keep an ear to the ground for opportunities. 
Viva libertad. Why did that just come up? Oh, because I walked up to the managed bandito operations. Recruits, increase your forces from bandito operations. Okay. Run bandito operations by deploying leaders and recruits. Leaders will join you upon completing operations in Yara stories. Recruits can be added by freeing hostages and defacing posters and destroying billboards. Okay, what do they do? You can unlock more bandito operations at the same time, which will have a higher chance of, for a better reward. Bandito has lost an experimental FND weapon running from a Jaguar. The gun is probably in a cave north of our position. Okay. One minute. We have one leader and 15 recruits. Surveyor. Plus 50% to construction success chance. Plus ne negative 50% to metal requirements. Lifelong, lifelong fisherman, home on the island of this one, Benito, well, the old one, actually, I guess it's a different island. Benito helped launch Libertard's first attack to free his island home, despite that failure, after Danny helped rid the island of Commandante de Rosario, Benito has returned to Libertard. He leads a team of offshore guerrilla operatives fighting for Yara's freedom and using his vast network for, I guess, a sign leader? Need 10 people? Alright, dispatch. That'll take about a minute. So, for anybody who is watching later on YouTube, I thank you for watching. This has been Far Cry 6, presented by Improvision Entertainment. I have been Huntermun. I will see you in the future.